Hello and welcome to Arsenal Online. Here you'll find the latest stories in this busy start to the season for the Gunners. Let's take a quick look at the latest news to emerge from the Emirates Stadium. Arsenal ditch, flop Pepe and move for Diaby. Finally, it seems that underperforming and very expensive signing Nicolas Pepe appears to be on his way out of the Emirates Stadium, with Mikel Arteta already lining up his potential replacement. What's the news? Well, the Ivory Coast forward is edging towards a move to France with League One club Nice after the player's agent was spotted at their stadium on Sunday. The club record £72 million signing has failed quite spectacularly to live up to his reputation since he was signed to the Gunners in 2019 by former manager Unai Emery. Breaking the club record at the time and earning one of the top salaries, Pepe just hasn't performed for Arsenal and has only been a bit player under Mikel Arteta. Having been dubbed a disaster by French broadcaster Matt Spiro in the past, the £140,000 per week Ivorian winger has managed only 27 goals and 21 assists in 112 games for Arsenal. That is not a great statistic for a £72 million rated player. Already... It seems Arteta may have his replacement lined up in the form of Bayern Leverkusen star Moussa Diaby, who could be the ideal replacement for Pepe. The latest reports say that Arsenal are closing in on a deal for Spanish youngster Jeremy Pino from Villarreal this summer, but a smash-and-grab raid could now be on for Diaby. Compared to Pepe's poor stats, Diaby, in the same three-season spell as Pepe, has scored 35 goals and grabbed 38 assists. That's a marked difference. Last season, he made 25 goal contributions compared to three for Pepe. Diaby is said to be available for just under £60 million, which is not cheap, but he's only 23 years of age and already a France international, and that is a hard squad to get into. A move to Arsenal would be a step in the right direction for Diaby and the Gunners. It would signal to the other big Premier League clubs, as if they don't already know, that Arsenal is now back in the game with a phenomenally improved squad. Thank you for watching our channel. Please subscribe and ring that bell if you would like the latest news from the Gunners.